When it comes to setting up the Amazon Fire Stick, there's a few things we need to sort of tweak to get the settings right, because you may not know that Amazon had an absolute nightmare for tracking you. And no, this isn't a VPN plug. There are settings on the Amazon Fire Stick that you really need to think about changing. In fact, I did a video a couple of years ago on this where Amazon Alexas are spying on you and collecting your data. Now we all know Amazon are notorious for doing this alongside Google. So what we're gonna do in this video is go through some of the settings, get them updated, get them changed, and give you the best Amazon Fire Stick settings to use in 2000. 25. Now we're not going to cover everything and give you a full Amazon Fire Stick setup. We're just going to go over some of the kind of essentials that we need to get sorted on the Fire Stick that's going to give you the best and optimized setup and go over what some of the things mean. And let me know what you like and what you dislike about the Amazon Fire Stick. Right, let's get on and set it up. Right, let's get these settings sorted. Head on over to the settings tab on the Amazon Fire Stick. Then we're going to go down to preferences. Right, let's start with parental control. Self-explanatory. If you've got kids and you want to turn it on, of course turn it on. I'm not going to. Head on down to privacy settings. Now, now, stored email addresses. If there's emails on there that you don't use no more, simply remove them. Head on down to cookie consent. I've got this turned off. This disables Amazon basically allowing the use of cookie identifiers on your device. This is mainly used for advertising purposes, so we don't want them collecting that data. Turn that off. So device usage data and collect app usage data, we're gonna turn them both off. That basically stops Amazon collecting data on our device and the apps we're using. Definitely don't want that happening, so turn them off. Now Amazon Photos is up to you. If you wanna see photos, leave it on. If you don't, turn it off. But interest-based ads, we're gonna turn that off as well. Basically, you'll have an advertising ID and Amazon will collect all your interest to be able to tailor ads. We don't want that. Unless you want personalized ads, that's up to you, but we're gonna turn it off. Now, go back to preferences, and then we're gonna go down to data usage monitoring. This basically monitors the consumption on your Fire Stick, so turn this off. Again, anyway, they're gonna collect data. We want to stop it happening. Right, go back and go down to featured content. Now, if you want the video and audio to auto play on the home screen on the Fire Stick, leave these on, but if you don't like it, turn it off. It can be super annoying if it's late at night and a video starts playing, and I'll show you what exactly this is. So that's these big ads on the top there. As we hover over them, they will start playing. And normally there's a video involved as well, but I've turned it off, so that's not gonna happen. And disabling these settings should stop Amazon from tracking you and what you're doing on your device. And that's it, all these settings are gonna be super useful and is gonna give you the optimized and best settings to stop Amazon tracking you in 2025. Anyway, if you found this video useful, drop a like, hit subscribe, and let me know in the comments section down below if there's anything you want me to release a video on or any tips or tutorials that you might find useful. It'll give me some great content ideas. Anyway, that's all for this one, guys. I will see you in the next one.